I met Corbin when I was still in college. We vibed right away. It was hard to do long distance. We wanted to make it work, but there was just too much jealousy. Eventually, I suspected that Corbin was cheating on me, so I hired someone to seduce him. But I never cheated. I miss her, and I think if we can trust each other, we can really have something special. I want to see if she'll give us a second chance. So are you ready to be honest and tell me that you're cheating on me? <sighs> is that how we're going to start this off? Yeah, that is it. We haven't talked about it yet. I didn't cheat on you. I know that you did. How do you know this? Because the girl you cheated with, I paid her 50 bucks to hit on you. Why would you pay a girl to talk to me? That's some crazy You are giving off horrible energy, and I had a series of events leading up to that. A series like of events? Like you flirting with other girls, you eyeing other girls. Who would I ever flirt with? Oh my gosh, all the girls at your gym? You're not at the gym, so how can you say I'm flirting with On Instagram. With them? I've seen it. What do you mean? You're over there liking all these girls' Instagram pictures, your workout buddies with all these different girls at your gym, and you're literally posting thirst traps, like, ab pigs, like, ah, uh, like. I'm a trainer. I have a fitness Instagram. So when I see other people that have fitness okay, pages, so you're gonna it's like, called oh, building them up. Sexy girl, oh, whatever, you're so sexy, you're gonna like that? It's yeah. for work. It's innocent flirting and help me get clients to continue to make money. What is like respectful in a relationship? Like, Trusting the person and not paying somebody to see if they would cheat. But it happened. Not true. You went on a date with this girl. It wasn't a date. She literally told me that you took her out to eat. Oh. No. Yeah, and you guys hooked up. You can't sit here and deny that. I am denying because it it's not true. It, okay, sure. She's a client, and after we were working out, we got food, which was across the street. That's where not we what walked. she told me. That's what I'm telling you. She told you. me you guys had sex. I'm telling you we didn't. So are you saying she's lying? I'm saying she's lying. Let's find out from her. Okay. All right. Oh my God. Paula, can you tell him what you told me? So I pretty much told her that you took me to this really fancy restaurant and afterwards we went back to my place and hooked up. And that he came on to you in the car and you guys are kissing? Yes. Yeah, see? Why hey. would you sit here and lie? I lied because... So you weren't telling Wait. the truth? I didn't think that she deserved you, so I lied. Where oh my God. Clearly, she doesn't value the faithful, amazing man that you are. I thought, you know, maybe <laughs> I have a chance because... So you thought you had a chance with him, so you're trying to homewreck us so that you can be with him? Wow. Thanks. <laughs> she lied to my face. And what have I been saying? All right, well, I'm sorry for doing that and making it go that far instead of talking to you about it. When I feel like someone's pulling away, I'll just pull away too. We were long distance, and I see you liking all Instagram girls' pictures, and you were not texting me as much, not calling me. I was working a lot, but that doesn't mean I was cheating on you. I'm really sorry. I mean, I appreciate your apology. It takes a lot to apologize, especially, you know, after all of that. I, I didn't fully understand, you know, everything that was going on. But now that I do, you know, it clearly makes sense as to why you are so upset. And it really just comes down to a communication issue. Mm -hmm. You know, and that doesn't seem like a good enough reason to throw everything that we had away. I miss you so much. Yeah, I miss you a lot. Being awkward. <laughs> I want you to give us a second chance. <laughs> Honestly, you're so cute. I feel like I should be asking you for the second chance after all of this bull. <laughs> uh. So is that a yes? Yeah. Yeah, yeah I want to try again. Right. <laughs> this is crazy. And to be honest, that was the very first episode that I watched that actually made me stay glued to that series. And in this year, I don't think any girl is going to like pay another girl to spy on her boyfriend or, her, or have something to do with her boyfriend or whatever. But the whole story sounds so stupid to me. To like comparing the girl's behavior, her attitude, and her step, but you cannot just we can't just like insult her because nobody knows what she was going to, why she made that decision. But if it is the way I watched it, then it sounds so stupid. So guys, drop your own opinion in the comment section. 
please don't forget to subscribe to my channel it's so sunny and i'm going out then i remember that i didn't finish i didn't conclude and i want to edit the video now so guys don't forget to subscribe to my channel and do not forget to comment like and share my videos see you in my next video bye